Good Saturday morning to you. I'm sure you got up this morning and thought, you know, the very first thing I want to do this morning is prepare my taxes. I've been thinking about it all night long, maybe couldn't even sleep a little bit. I wanted to get my taxes done. Well, if you're like me, you'll probably procrastinate, but that's okay. So I, what I wanted to do today is just give you a couple of things to remember to help you on, in your tax situation. Okay, so the very first thing is, is in 2013, if you closed a mortgage loan, whether it was a purchase or a refinance, then you may be eligible to, uh, for a tax deduction. So what you need to do is get your settlement statements. Your settlement statements are part of your closing packet that you signed at the closing table. They're generally at the front of the packet. Um, take these settlement statements, you say right across the top, settlement statements, to your accountant and you may have some charges associated with your mortgage that you closed that could be tax deductible. So that's a, that's a tip right there. If you can't find those, give me a call and I can help you uh, track those down. The next one is, doesn't matter when you close your mortgage, but you should have received a 1098 in the mail um, or email uh, from your current mortgage lender who you make your payments to. And they will, uh, the, the 1098 outlines all of the mortgage interest that you've paid for the year, and uh, that is generally tax deductible also. So, now one thing too is if your mortgage has been transferred or sold, you should be looking for two 1098s. A funny thing actually, this morning as I was going through my mail, I thought this was junk mail, I was about ready to throw it in the trash. As it turns out, it was actually a 1098 from uh, one of my mortgage lenders, so I'm glad I didn't throw it in the trash. So don't throw any of your mortgage statements or anything in the trash from your mortgage lender this time of year. So settlement statements, 1098, take them to your accountant, and good luck with your taxes this year. As always, thanks for working with me.